Hi everybody, this is Tyler over at Turboise. Just want to go through basically the simple calibration process of your accelerometers and the gimbal. This will happen sometimes if you're going to an area where there's a higher temperature or lower temperature. Sometimes that pressure can set off your accelerometers. So what you're going to want to do is connect to a computer via USB cable. You might have to download the drivers, the USB to UART driver or the CP210X driver for your computer. Once you download that driver, you need the USB to mini USB cable, and you want to make sure to get a data cable too, not just a power cable. Download the software for your computer. Now this is Simple BGC GUI 2.43B9. There is a newer version out there, but you do not want to get that one as it will erase all the settings that are saved on the gimbal. So you want to stick with version 2.43B9. The gimbal does not need to be power on or have a battery in it but it's recommended that a camera is mounted in it while you're doing this. So once it's connected to the GUI, you'll hear the computer make that sound. That means it's connected. You go up to the connection port, select whichever port that it's connected to, and then hit the connect button, and you'll see it start to read. Once it's connected, you can see it start to read all your sensors. By rolling it, you'll see the roll axis move, pitch, yaw, everything moving correspondingly. Now to calibrate the sensors, under the basic tab, if you go down here to calibrate IMU, click the calibrate IMU button. The first sensor we're gonna calibrate is the camera IMU, and that's the sensor right here inside the camera frame with the red LED. So for this one, you wanna take the gimbal off the stand, set it on the table so it's level. You don't have to worry about the handlebars you're doing just to make sure that they're not moving, setting everything off, and then hit the calibrate button for the accelerometer. and then the calibrate for the gyroscope. And the idea there is that when you're done, the gyroscope, the bar here, ends in the green zone to let you know that it's in the safe zone, basically. Once that's completed, you can pick up the gimbal, place it back on the tuning stand, and you wanna hold the gimbal so it's nice and level. Doesn't have to be perfect, but just make sure it's not moving. And now we're gonna select the frame IMU sensor, which is in the back, which is right here behind the gimbal board. And we're gonna do the same process. We're gonna calibrate the accelerometer, and then the gyroscope. And again, the idea is that we end with the status bar in the green zone. And then once that's done, you can close the window, hit the right button, and then disconnect. Once you've disconnected, turn off, well, the gimbal doesn't have to be on for that process, but then we can power on the gimbal and just make sure everything else works.